Hey guys, uh, KG5 Accus here. I am making a video on uh, how to make your belt last longer. Um, so, um, um, I really had a technique to start out first, but then Matt, uh, currently or whatever the channel is called, he, uh, the guy made a video of this, of how to make your belt last longer. It's where you in so technically you know when you're about to vacuum you take the nozzle off you turn it and then you do the usual and then you know and so when the belt's connected you know you vacuum it but then you know people normally leave it on and what that does is it lets the belt keep on being stretched so I'm going to pass on this piece of advice how to make your belt last longer so what you do after you're done vacuuming and carpet is you take off the nozzle turn the belt lifter until the green arrows line up and then just put without turning it to the red arrow just um, uh, you just put it up and lock it in place so that the belt is off and that will make the belt have a longer life and then when you want to use it again you just you know repeat the steps I did earlier um if you're a guy like Kirby Vacuum Collector and Fixer who um leaves his nozzles off after um after using them just because you, ha you have so much it's just easier to store them with the nozzles off and honestly, I find that idea brilliant. I mean, if you have uh, at, uh, the same amount or as much Kirby's as Kirby Ben Collector and Fixer does, it's always a good idea to like keep the nozzles off. But like when the nozzles off, keep the green arrow until it's lined up. That will give the belt a longer life. This was not recommended by me. This was recommended by another YouTuber, Matt. I totally recommend checking his channel out and. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos.